London, UK, this is our last question tonight. What's the ruling on buying a pin or having a pin that has a little bit of gold on it? First and foremost is it depends whether you're going to wear the pin or whether you're going to write with the pin or whether you're going to give the pin as a gift or have the pin sitting there. Different rulings for all of those scenarios. In brief, the ulama of Islam, they say, is that if there's a little bit of gold on the nib or the cap of the pin, and it isn't enough gold to be sold, it isn't enough gold to be weighed, there's no value in the gold. I'm not saying this is gold, I'm not saying that it's not, but as an example, this nib here, let's say the nib was 12 karat, 14 karat gold, the nib. If the nib was removed, can it be sold? Is there value? If it's value in it, then they say it's impermissible for a man to have the pen or to wear it. And others, they may say that if the nib can't be sold, there's no value, then it's what? Permissible. Also, the Ulema of Islam, they mention certain small pieces and additions. It could be like this on a cap here, just around the tip, like that. It's, it's, a, it's a trifling amount of gold. It's of no tangible value. You can't point it in. You can't melt it into anything. And it's shay'un ghayr maqsood bihi. It's not the intention behind the pen. Everyone understand this? Sometimes you have parts, parts of a watch, or parts of certain phones. They have what? Gold in it. That's not the intention. It's not the same as having a gold watch in which it's made to what? To look nice. Everyone understand? There's a difference. So the ulama of Islam they mention is that there are different scenarios with regards to a man having a gold pen. Sheikh bin Baz, rahimahullah, he gave the fatwa that a man should not have a gold pen. And qalam, having a qalam, ya'khud hukm al lips, it's like what? Wearing. And there are others who have different details and different rulings. The points that I just get, mentioned and given you make it much easier. How much gold is on the pen? What's meant by the gold? Is it plated? Is it solid? Well, heck Huh? Allah Azza wa Jalla surely knows best. Thank you very much for tuning in.